When you hear the words VR headset, you might think of clunky devices that hang off your face, right? Well, not anymore. Today, I'm here to introduce you to the future of VR. Let's dive in. All right, picture this. The big screen beyond isn't your average VR headset. It's more like a sleek pair of VR goggles. Unlike those headsets, loaded with bells and whistles, the Beyond focuses on delivering the ultimate VR experience in the simplest way possible. And here's the kicker. It's ultra compact, weighing in at just 1,027 grams, which is about a quarter of the weight of the Quest 2. Now, here's where it gets interesting. The Beyond isn't a one-size-fits-all deal. Nope. It's custom made for each user. How? Well, you start by scanning your face with your iPhone. And I'm talking millimeter precision here. Once that's done, they create a face gasket made of this gel-like material. And the headset fits on your face like it was tailor-made for you. No more worrying about different face shapes or IPD, the distance between your pupils. It's personalized to you. And that's a game changer for comfort and immersion. All right, let's dive into the display on the big screen beyond. This bad boy comes with not one, but two 2560 by 2560 micro OLED displays that run at 75 to 90 hertz refresh rates. Now, why is this a big deal? Well, these displays are basically magic. Micro OLEDs are like 8,000 times faster than those old LCD screens, which means they can paint a picture of incredibly realistic shadows and contrasts. When you put on this headset, it's like you've stepped into a whole new world. The visuals are so stunning, it's almost like reality on steroids. The Beyond might not be the brightest kid on the block when it comes to VR headsets, but it's got a nifty trick up its sleeve. Thanks to its custom face gasket, it makes sure no light sneaks in. So when you put it on, all you see is what's coming from those amazing displays. And that's a one-way ticket to full immersion. Oh, and now you can tweak the brightness to suit your liking. But here's a little heads up. Avoid playing horror games in pitch darkness with this thing on. Seriously, it's like stepping into a whole new world of terror. You won't see any real world escape routes, and that's a whole new level of spooky. And hey, we can't leave out the Beyond's killer microphone. The audio quality is top notch, and some might even say it's the best you can get in any VR headset. It's a total game changer, especially if you're into creating content. Your voice will sound like a dream. And it's like an instant upgrade for content creators. It's like having a pro-grade studio mic right on your headset. Let's talk about the beyond size, weight, and comfort. My friend, it's seriously impressive. This thing is compact and lightweight, which means you won't be feeling like you've got a brick hanging off your head. No more neck strain. And that's a game changer. And get this. There's no annoying hot spot from the weight resting on your cheeks. It's all about even weight distribution and comfort. Plus, it's custom made to fit your face like a glove, thanks to that face scan we mentioned earlier. So you'll be spending more time in VR. And trust me, it's going to be a whole lot more comfortable. It's like wearing a cloud on your face, but a cloud that takes you into another world. Time to talk lenses, my friend. So the Beyond comes with these pancake lenses and they've made some upgrades, but they're not flawless. In those scenes with super high contrast, you might catch a tiny bit of a glare. And here's the deal breaker. There's this slight distortion ring around the very edge. 
and the sweet spot for these lenses is a tad small. So when you first put it on, you might, it might take you a few seconds to get everything perfectly sharp. It's like a camera lens. You gotta focus it just right to get the best view. It's a minor thing, but worth knowing. All right, let's chat about the field of view on the beyond. On a good day, you're looking at around 101 degrees, which is pretty sweet. It's a bit better than what you'd get with the Quest 2, and just a smidge less than the Index. Now, it's not the absolute wildest field of view you can find out there, but here's the scoop. The Beyond makes up for it, big time, with all the other awesome features. So yeah, it's not the biggest room at the party, but it's got some killer music and snacks that more than make up for it. All right, here's the deal. Should you go for the big screen beyond? If you're already rocking the Steam VR gear with controllers and base stations, it's a fantastic upgrade. It fits right into your setup. And you're in for a treat with those top-notch displays and comfort. It's like giving your VR experience a turbo boost. But now, if you're not already a Steam VR user, or you're counting your pennies, there are some more budget-friendly options out there. The Beyond is like a tailored suit. It offers some unique perks, but it's an investment, especially for the VR enthusiasts out there. So you gotta weigh the pros and the cons and see if it fits your style and wallet. If you're a PC VR enthusiast or looking to take your VR experience to the next level, Consider the big screen beyond. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to NextGen for more exciting tech reviews and VR insights. Let us know in the comments if you've tried the beyond or if you have any questions. Until next time, keep exploring the world of technology.